Hi, Donna Nichols here, and our scripture today comes from 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 11. Encourage one another and build each other up, just as in fact you are doing. You know, loving others includes encouraging one another. And in Romans 12, 7 through 8, Paul lists encouragement among the gifts of grace. When people accomplish a common objective together, all are encouraged. Fellow believers encourage one another to grow in the grace and knowledge of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. The Thessalonian Christian face struggles in an uncertain future. Paul wrote to encourage them, reminding them of their faith and love and hope in Christ, all of which prepared them to be ready for the Lord's return. And with these assurances, they could keep encouraging one another and building each other up. The gift of encouragement is important in our lives. Encouragement is a gift in the home, the workplace, the church, wherever we find ourselves. We can come alongside others and be there for one another. We can listen, comfort, console, and affirm. It's a way of living out the command to love one another. So take time to recall the people who've been encouragers in your life. They're the ones who were there when you thought you'd never laugh again. They were the ones who listened to you, whereas others just talked. Then ask yourself, when was the last time I encouraged someone? It's not difficult, and the people you encourage are so blessed by it. Will you pray with me, please? Lord Jesus, help me to recognize the struggler or the lonely, anyone who needs your encouragement of love and hope today. In your name, amen.